Hey, the slack dude is back playing some more RE4. And my Mr. Spot Spidey Sense is tingling. Here we go. Now we got door number one and door number two. Door number two is locked. We're going to unlock that later on. By working our way around through the doggy maze and down through there. And then we get trapped in a cage with a prisoner. Oh joy, with a whole bunch of other ganados. And then finally we get to work our way down into here. And in this room are a whole bunch of goodies. Right? So you don't want to miss that. For now, let's take on some of the the wildlife. <laughs> See that? Yeah. Try as I might, I've shot those crows down many times and they never yield up any goodies. Nothing whatsoever. However, three crows on the fountain here will give goodies. If you can shoot them just right. Shoot the ones on the bottom first. And then shoot the alpha crow on the top. Because otherwise they'll fly away. You always get three jewels here. Plus some extra moolah, depending on how many crows you shot down. Now! Did you buy the Broken Butterfly Magnum? Shame on you. Because you know what? There's a free one in there. But we can't get it for now. Because we need a little help from our friend. Right? When we get Ashley back... Yeah, I told you, we gotta get her back. That's, that's part of the game. Okay? When we get Ashley back, um, do a piggyback thing in here. Then she climbs up in there opens the door for you and you get to go in there and raid the place and amongst the loot is the broken butterfly magnum for free a really powerful handgun yeah the Slackster is about to get down and dirty with some dirty dogs. <laughs> That's right, Slack Doggy. Y'all come with me, you can be watching my back while I run through this maze here and massacre some mangy mutts. And I'm gonna try to do a perfect run through here. I've done it before. See if I can record it. And if I do manage to pull it off, y'all got to give me a big thumbs up. <laughs> Mr. Kennedy. Still alive, I see. So, do you like my garden? I see you've managed to work in a little of your twisted taste here, too. <laughs> Sagacious as I am, even I get lost here sometimes. Even if it takes your whole life, you'll never get out. Do you know that no one dies without a cause? You will satisfy the stomachs of my cute pets. Now if you'll excuse me, I have to tie up a few loose ends, like chasing down a couple of rats. Two rats? If one's Lewis, who's the other? Huh, they're an intruder besides me? Yeah. Okay, so, what's the deal? Here's where we can we have to continue, okay? The door is locked. The door is locked because we need two halves of a blue moonstone. Two moons make one. And the two halves of the blue moonstone are at the fountains. One there and one down over there. All right, so we have to collect both those halves of the moonstones, put them together, and plunk it in the door, and we could be on our merry way. But this maze, this garden maze, is just full of dogs. They're quick, they're dodgy, and they're dangerous. So crank out your scatter gun and get ready to rock and roll. And use the red nine to save ammo if you need. And there are a couple of places 
where you can ambush them if you don't go gang busting in. See, if you go gang busting in there, those dogs down there will come at you. But if you just stay out here, nice and safe. Frank on your old sniper rifle. Let one have it right in the mug. We can crank on the shotgun. Let the other one have it. And finish him off with the red nine. Yeah, there. Collect the goodies. Reload. And we could be on a merry way. Now. The way to the first statue is that way to collect the first half of the blue moonstone. But first, we're going to get five shotgun shells around the corner here in this treasure chest. And this treasure chest is a trigger. As soon as you grab the treasure, a couple of dogs come at you. Best place to position yourself is right here so that you get them funneled right there, okay? They won't be able to flank you. Grab the shotgun shells, get ready to rock and roll, and let them have it with a box shot shampoo. Yeah, yeah. Onward. Let's go get the first half of the blue moonstone. There we go. Now, this is the hardest part. You get assaulted by four dogs just around the corner here, and I figured the best thing to do is just sneaky peek around the corner here. Like that. In your face, little doggy. <laughs> yeah, you tell him, slack doggy. And don't forget this TMP ammo over here, if that's your thing. Onward. Now I just heard something else out down there. I hear him puffing and puffing. Yeah, get some. Click the yellow herb. Click the fl ooh flash grenade. By the way, if you got a flash grenade and a regular frag grenade, hang on to them because you're gonna need them for the prisoner part. Yeah. Next thing on the agenda, we're going to go for that that jewel right there. That's a red gem for the elegant mask. But of course, it ain't going to be that easy. Get down. Yeah. Ouch. Red gem. Combine that with the elegant mask, and we got ourselves an elegant mask with two gems in it. Need one more, and then we can sell it. Okay, we got that, we got that. Let's go get the second half of the blue moonstone. The blue moon. There we go. Got both halves of the blue moonstone. Where am I? Yeah, that's where I want to be. Go sneaky peeky around the corner here. Got another dog down there. Oops. <laughs> that you can take out with a sniper rifle. If you go around the other way, he's gonna sucker punch you. So best to go this way. And he's kinda tough. Get down. 
Bad doggy. Bad, bad doggy. There we go, and he coughs up some goodies. Thank you, Vito. And... Just around the corner, right there, is a first aid spray. So if the dogs ruffled your feathers a little bit, that's where you can go to get freshened up. And there's one final thing we got to pick up. I think it's a spinel. Right there. Yay. Got him. <laughs> Owza, yowza, yowza. Thumbs up for the slack doing a perfect run through the doggy maze. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And that's it. Got both halves of the blue moonstone. Got all the goodies. Let's get on out of here. At least I think I got all the goodies. If I didn't, <laughs> I'm definitely going to hear about it. <laughs> So you use the blue moonstone on the door there, and the door opens up, and we're in like Flynn. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. Put them up now. Try using knives next time. Works better for close encounters. Leon. Long time no see. Ada. So it is true. True? About what? You, working with Wesker. I see you've been doing your homework. Why, Ada? What's it to you? Why are you here? Why'd you show up like this? <laughs> See you around. Ada! Wait, can I call you? Maybe we could have dinner sometime. You know, maybe some Asian food? You know, cream of some young guy? Eh? What do you say? Jeez, what happened to my hit ratio? <laughs> uh, come on, come on. I just did a perfect run for the doggy maze. And of course we're going to save the game. And if you thought this was all just a whole bunch of fun, please, please, give me a thumbs up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much.